I want to push the envelope a little bit on questioning your biases. Why is it that the unknown is scary? Why is it that we tend to be afraid of the dark? Stepped outside, middle of the night, the rain has passed, noises that would be normal in the day kind of startle you. You ever have that thing where you wake up and you see something and it takes you a few minutes to realize it's just a shirt on a coat hanger? The question is, what do we believe and do we really believe it? Every culture has belief in spirits on some level, and practically every major religion and most minor ones have a sense of or belief in the demons. In some contexts, demons is just a general term for spirit. In others, it's actually um, what most of us would consider, like from horror movies and such, something evil, something frightening, something ghostly. So, have you ever thought about those beliefs shared by so many? We're talking about investigating our bias, looking at what we believe, what we think, what we believe about what others believe. What are we willing to accept? So, I have an article from a psychiatrist who actually helps exorcists determine if people are dealing with a known psychological problem or if there is no psychological explanation which means that the exorcist could potentially and, and reasonably expect to deal with the demonic period. What do you think about that? This is our discussion board this time. Um, I want you to read the article. And um, kind of be challenged by it. Do you find it believable? Do you not find it believable? Why or why not? Um, you know, remember to follow those general instructions on um, discussion boards. Um, don't just say, well, I believe in it, or I don't believe in it, or that's a load of crock, or that's really scary. Tell me why you find it believable, why you don't find it believable. What, what in your own history, what in your own experience makes you think it's believable or not? Um, ask yourself if you can take seriously people who believe in it. Realize that if you can't, you have to dismiss many, 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 many people. Some of them quite intelligent throughout history and around the world. Um, some of them very noble. So, what do you do with phenomena like this? How do you, how do you address it? What do you think about it? Um, that's what I want you to look at with this discussion board as you read this article.